You know, I was speaking at an energy conference in Fort Myers about a month ago, and we were talking about the trends coming into the world of energy. Do you know what's happening, which is so absolutely freaky in the energy industry? The MP3 industry is set to change the energy industry. We're getting the capability in our backyards for solar power, for wind power, for biomass energy generation. And what is happening in the utility industry is we're realizing, you know, these folks are now saying, well, I got a little bit of extra energy here. You want me to share it with you? They are creating their own private energy grids. We shared music. Why don't we share energy? And the energy utility industry realizes it's in for a period of massive business model disruption as local energy networks begin to appear everywhere. Think about how quickly battery technology is being developed. Think about what Google is announcing. Right now, the challenge with electric cars is what we call range anxiety. We can only drive a Tesla so far you know, before we run out of juice. Battery technology is accelerating so quickly that that is going to be a thing of the past. There are companies in the energy industry right now. We're going to sit back in 10 years and we're going to realize, wow, they were like an apple in that they came in and provided the infrastructure and the support and the business model to, to support these private energy neighborhood grids. And we're going to be in a world in which people will be able to print their own solar panels on their own 3D printers in their home. I'm not making this stuff up because this is the stuff that people are talking about at the conferences which I am going to open. Think about the evolution of careers. Think about what is going to emerge here. Robotic pharmaceutical therapy monitors. We're entering a world of intelligent medicine. Medicine that actually, as you take it, has tiny sensors embedded in the pill so that it tracks internally how well it is working. We are witnessing the career of water footprint analysis. You know, water is one of the biggest challenges of our time. This region is in the midst of a huge water drought. And there is a career of people who are responsible for me measuring the usage of water by people, industry, <laughs> golf courses, anything else. We're witnessing careers of people known as vertical farming infrastructure managers. We're witnessing the careers of drone, helicopter insurance, crop risk management. I don't make this stuff up. That's what I was talking about with these farmers two weeks ago in this very area. We are in a world in which people are talking about vertical farm infrastructure managers. At that conference, what, what we were speaking about is that 70% of the Earth's population will be living in urban centers by the year 2050. Urban farming is becoming a major area of global growth with year-round crop production. You know, one indoor acre is the equivalent of four to six acres of crop. What is happening is here, it virtually eliminates an agricultural runoff. We can recycle the water. And not only that, we can generate energy through methane production. This is real stuff real people are talking about. Big, bold, transformative ideas. And what's the impact on you? Well, we've got to think about the rapid emergence of new skills, new professions, the, 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 the impact upon the existing skills and professions that we are providing testing capabilities for.